Yo, what's going on guys? How are you doing? It back with another class setup, and today we're gonna be looking at the MP5. The MP5 recently got buffed, and it's now insane. Like the damage is insane for the fire rate, and we can have it have make it have like no recoil. It's just an absolute machine. Um, so I'll be going getting straight um, into this class setup. I won't be doing any gameplay because I know most of you just want to see the class setup. And that's why I'm going to get straight into it. So, for the for the perks, we're just going to have Ninja, Spycraft, Scavenger, Quartermaster, and your general Flat Jack and Tactical Mask. Um, I've Stims, Stim Shot, and then either Semtex or C4. I know a lot of people use C4, and that's fair enough, but personally, I use Semtex. Um, and then for your field, field upgrades, um, I use Field Mic, but that's your personal preference although I recommend using the field mic. Um, onto your secondary um, anything anything works really like uh, a shotgun, dual diamadis, dual magnums but personally I use the dual diamadis and uh, finally onto the mp5 attachments first of all you don't need an optic because the, op the um, iron sights really good in the first place for the muzzle we want to roll with the SOCOM eliminator just for that vertical, mainly for that vertical recoil control. Um, and now we want to go to our underbarrel. And for underbarrel, we want the field agent grip because that tremendously buffs the horizontal recoil control and a bit more of the vertical recoil control, which is what we need. Next onto our magazine, 40 round speed mag. It The stats on this are really good, although it does decrease slightly decrease the aim ADS time. But... It already ADS is really quick, so that's not an issue at all. Um, next on our handling, we want to then go and sort of retrieve that ADS time um, with that extra 25%. And the reason we're not using the airborne elastic wrap this time is because, because obviously the sprint to fire fire time is is decreased more, and the shooting movement speed is is decreased, and you're with the airborne elastic wrap, you only get an extra 5% ADS time, so it's all in all, it's not really worth it. Um, and finally, we want to be using all the way at the bottom the radar stop just to get that extra movement speed and mobility. And it does decrease the hip fire accuracy, but you won't really need to hit fire at all. Just ADS and this thing is an absolute laser. Anyway, guys, that's my class setup. Leave any suggestions um, in the comment section below. Make sure you like the video and I'll see you next time.